Pokemon Sip with Austin Warrior Arts, Seth Dakota, and to Jenga or not to Jenga, that is the question. So um, recently, uh, my uh, my buzz for Capoeira has been reignited, and I've wanted to kind of focus on, um, we'll say, functional uh, Capoeira, like Capoeira has its functions um, in a fight context, whether that's MMA, whether that's self-defense, or just stand-up fighting. Uh, so one of the big things, or one of the, the obstacles that capoeiristas have to um, in, encounter is how functional is the Jenga as a, as, a fighting, as a fighting stance or a fighting movement. And if it, is, if it isn't functional, how can we make it more functional? Okay, so here's um, a drill, a concept to kind of build uh, uh, a more functional Jenga as far as like fighting, uh, as fighting is concerned. So when we typically see the Jenga, we recognize this triangle step as the Jenga. Uh, truth be told that the Jenga, Jenga means to, to sway or to swing. Um, especially like when you walk and it was um, the Jenga was kind of a, uh, a telltale sign in the way that the malandros in Rio moved. There was one in, in one aspect. So the Jenga in the way that we define it and, and envision it is not just this triangle step or box step, however you conceptualize it, but the Jenga is, is movement, okay? Moving in different planes, okay? And so we're going to kind of explore that in more of a um, a stand-up context. Okay, so the first drill, we're gonna go slow. My partner here is gonna just take like a box of guard and he's gonna work on just using his hands, okay? So as I'm as I'm with my partner, I'm gonna be moving and insert uh tips that are gonna be used to kind of disrupt his his forward movement, alright? So now his hands are up, it's in your, your hand here. So I'm gonna try my best not to stand and switch my feet in hand range, but I want to try to hover just kind of outside of that. As a capoeirista, keep your hand down. As a capoeirista, I'm used to seeing, I'm used to leg range. So he throws a kick, I'm used to in, in seeing that range. So I want to stay just in that sweet spot where if he does use his hand, he has to over extend the hip, okay? So, bang. Moving myself off to the side, I'm going to intercept with chapas, with Ben Siles, with oblique kicks, and with Martellos, okay? So, we're gonna go a little slower, and um, we'll try this out. Ready? <laughs> so you can see if I can get my fighter my opponent to play that game I can stay on the outside and do a lot of changing now if I don't have a lot of room, I may not be able to accomplish this the same way. But this is a start for Capoeiras to start using this in a more stand-up context. One more time. I'm out here, he punches, I intercept, Chapa, Van South, Oblique, Martello. Okay? <laughs> Alright? Anyhow, so. I'm winded, but something for you guys to play around with at home. Thank you. Peace.